Okay, we're doing the wacky gender prediction test. Which pretty much means Jamie's gonna pee in things. Well, kind of. Okay. No, give a pound. High five. Boom. Pound. Boom. But this baby, I saw the doctor today. There's the bump. You see it, right? It's oh, there, I see right? It. <laughs> Please tell me it's there. I like the bump. <laughs> but this baby is either a boy or a girl. We got 50 50 chance, Doug. I know. Of either or. <laughs> and there's like these wacky gender prediction tests out there and before we're gonna find out we have our gender reveal party this weekend so we're gonna find out for sure but i was like i want to see how many of these things are accurate so here we go what's the first one doug what do i have to pee in you don't pee in anything oh your urine is not valid your urine is useless here it's messed up your urine means nothing <laughs> you wouldn't have that baby without me <laughs> you wouldn't have that baby without me <laughs> okay, so we've got Drano, cabbage, baking soda, string, and rings, you know, the ring test, uh, what, a shot glass, I'm not sure what that's for, not gonna lie, and then two cups, one I'm just gonna quickly take a drink of some water because I'm really thirsty, you gotta stay hydrated in pregnancy, I'm gonna drink water and then I'm gonna go pee in this. Before we do any tests though, you have to right now in the comments, put your prediction because I don't want it to be like tainted. Or actually I guess you can do it at the end, whatever you decide, because you still don't know. We, we don't know, but we're gonna know this weekend. I, that right there, Doug, is the, the gender of our baby. It's in there. I do find it interesting. This was not planned, but oh uh, my gosh. you're wearing blue and I'm wearing pink. That wasn't planned. Mm -hmm. That just kind of happened, <laughs> but it's appropriate. In this test, you boil red cabbage, save the water, mix it with your urine. If the water turns pink, you're having a girl. If the water's purple, you're having a boy. Oh, interesting. Where's the specimen? I'm gonna go put it in. <clears throat> be right back. Looks like it's boiling. I see you. Stop it, Doug. I really? feel like a creeper. Oh my god, you're I get what? Doug! This is what? the pee! Oh. This is very purple. Right? No, it's blue. Yeah, this is very purple. Mm-hmm. Is that enough, you think? No. I would say fill halfway. I don't have that much pee though. I know. You fill it halfway. You wanna get the same amount of pee as cabbage. Over. I dare you to take a drink. Oh, right. Okay, here we go. I'm gonna. This is so disgusting. Okay, but let me do it. It's my urine. Mm. Does it turn? It's turning pink! It turns purple right away. That means it's a girl! It does mean it's a girl. Oh my god! Whoa! That changed right away. Yeah, that, and that was not very yellow. No, it didn't turn pink. It, this is totally, it, It's yes. purple. If the water is purple, it's a boy. Doug, Doug, that water was blue and now it's, this purple. is pink compared to what it was. That is purple, James. This is pink compared to what it was. Don't you agree? No, that is purple. Yeah. All right, so the next test is the ring test. So we have string here and my husband, this is his. Yeah third wedding band that I've had to buy him. So the first one we actually got for free from being married at first sight. But then the second one I bought him, which was really a nice one. It was very expensive. Someone lost it. He lost both of them. So this one is straight up from like Amazon or something. It's really not that expensive. <laughs> you could get this at like the dollar store. <laughs> if you hang the ring from a string over your belly, if the ring swings back and forth, it's a girl. If it swings in a circle, <laughs> You're carrying a boy. Okay, here we go. Oh my God. <laughs> you did that, Doug. Oh, hey, hey, this is a big boy. Doug, you did that, come on. <laughs> I'm not moving my hand whatsoever. 
This is like voodoo. <laughs> it's going like this, don't you think? What? Don't you think it's just going like this? I'm gonna get up again. Move. Oh. It's a circle. It's barely moving. <laughs> But I don't know. I don't want to sway it one way or the I other. Know. I don't trust you. you went, we went ghost hunting once, and he cried saying that. I did. He, I did he, feel so. I he felt, felt sad. Something, and he started crying. I felt I sad. Like, I don't just cry on point. <laughs> You're the one laying here with a ring over your belly. <laughs> You're the one holding it. <laughs> it's my ring. I do this all the time. Ay, ay, ay. All right, I think we're on to the next one. The baking soda test. Yeah, get some baking soda, you put it in a little shot glass like this, and then you pour some urine in it, and if it fizzes, it's a girl, and if it doesn't fizz... If it uh, fizzes, I think it's a boy. Check the rules, Doug. If it fizzes, it's a boy, oh, like I said. Fizz. Oh, okay then. All fizzy, right. fizzy. So here we go. I think we should really... I feel like we should wear eye goggles. I know, this is a science experiment. Also, You're like, going right on my phone. He's <laughs> <laughs> <Please>, Doug. <laughs> ah, oh, it's dripping. out of my hand. It's fizzing. Does that, is that fizzing? Yeah. Is that fizz? That's totally fizzing. Mm -hmm. It bubbles. But now it's not. So is that like a lot of fizz? I don't know. Oh my god! I just spilled urine on my counter! And it got on my arm. Oh, that's not funny. <laughs> He's such a kid. <laughs> Gotta let it fizz. It's a boy. Wait, that's <laughs> on our... I don't think that it fizz. Wait, Doug, put some more... I mean, that is urine, sure. I don't think it fizz. You saw a bubble? I did see like some bubbles, but yeah. is that like enough of a face? Like there needs to be like some sort of like... Yeah, they give like a short paragraph. Yeah, like fizz. Like, I mean, there's a lot of different fizz like ways that it could have fizzed. You probably, you probably have to read all the way through because it probably says at the end, ha ha, we just made you play with the urine. <laughs> That'd be a pretty good test. Right? Not okay, wait a second. That'd so, be really funny. Let's do the Drano one now. I feel like this is just a prank. Yeah, so it's gonna say ha ha. Buy Drano. Like I don't ever buy Drano. This Why a... would we need crystal Drano here? What is this for? This is Henley's medicine thing. And you're gonna spill it again. No, I'm not. I'm gonna pour it in. I'm not sucking it up with that. It goes in her mouth. Uh, I feel like this is seriously a prank. So you have to go out and buy like baking soda and Drano. Like they all went to cahoots and, and like, handle urine. Yeah, no, they're like, listen, if you want better sales, tell pregnant people right. to buy our yeah. product and then pour their urine on it. Right. So let's see what crazy I'm people just, will do. I'm just adding an, another gender prediction. I have a book out. It's called Wifey 101. You can go ahead and buy it. Yeah, it'll actually tell just you what pee. your baby is. You just pee in a Put cup. Put it on the book. Put up, the book gets wet. It's it gets yellow a little and wet. Okay. It's a girl. Yeah. If it, just is clear wet, it's a boy. It works 100% of the time, yep. nearly half the time. Yep. Okay, so here we go. This is the drain test. Eyes. <laughs> it's, got, it's got skull and crossbones on the <laughs> packaging. They're going to put it next to my face. Uh, <laughs> I'm not sure this Which is Which one's even, worse? I don't know. I'm not holding on to What is the phone. result for this one? Though? If it turns brown, it's a boy. Okay. What if it's a girl? It doesn't turn I don't know. Thing. I'll look after it. No change. Okay, it's a girl. Okay, so here we go. Oh. oh. I gotta, I gotta go put this oh. down before it drips on something. This is definitely not turning brown. Mm -mm. That looks white to me. It's like yellow. Basically looks like very right Yeah. That's <laughs> what it is. Get it away <laughs> from my face. So far, it seems like it's definitely more a boy than a girl, right? I would say that it's 50-50. You think 50-50? Yeah. So another test is if I carry high or low. So if high, it's a girl, and low, it's a boy. I mean, that's such a subjective question. Like, how do you say high or low? And like, maybe if I show it like this, it looks high. And if I show it like that, it looks low. Or, low. or vice versa. Is this carrying? She Mommy's carrying on. Does mommy have a baby brother or a baby sister in her belly? 
Which one does mommy have? Oh, girlfriend, it's one of them. <laughs> it's in there. Well, I'm gonna go with. I mean, does it look high or does it look low? To. Mommy's pick. It looks middle. I agree. Like, Maybe it's too early to tell. Can you Maybe stop you saying that? I am. 15 weeks pregnant I know, right but maybe now. This, maybe this was from a test that did it when you were like ready to go and people didn't get the blood test. Oh yeah, you know? that could be it. Okay, our final test is gonna be Gracie's hairline. Yeah. All right, Doug, how's it go? All right. So it's an old Native American legend. Uh, well, we're not Native American. So Actually, I have Na I have Actually, Cherokee in yeah, me. My mom said. and me said that I'm part Iroquois. Um, and I have Cherokee, so we are a wee uh, bit. We're from competing tribes. <laughs> That's probably why we fight all the time. <laughs> um, the neck hairline of your previous child can predict the gender of your current pregnancy. Okay. If the hairline goes straight across the baby, <laughs> which goes straight across. <gasps> it looked like it went straight across. What? Okay, what happens if it goes straight across? Because hers goes straight across. If it goes, if the hairline goes straight across, the baby will be the same sex no, as the first my. child. It's a girl then. If the hairline goes to a point, the baby will be opposite sex of your first child. I know that was a fast view, but it's definitely a girl because hers goes straight across. Whoa! You go down head first like a normal person. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Okay, so I'm dying to know if you guys think we're gonna have a little boy or a little girl. I know. Because it's literally still 50-50 after all of those wacky gender tests. I'm stuck. It's still 50-50. I'm stuck. Uh, I'm gonna go rescue my husband. My foot's stuck my on the slide. My biggest all. Stuck on the slide. <laughs> and I'm gonna be checking these comments because I'm curious to see if you guys think boy or girl. Because, like I said, I, literally, <laughs> after 15 wacky wind, wind, oh, wender, gender reveal baby. tests, where to go? That's what it's gonna be. <laughs> See you guys next week when we upload another Hot Marriage Cool Parents episode. And please subscribe and like this video because we like hanging out with you guys. Peace ah. out.